Our collection connected back to open another fat pack of uh, Forgotten Realms. Walmart had a full restock today. Um, ten of these and full collector's packs and everything. So, as we try to get Driz and Guinevar and some of the dragons, the named dragons out of here, that's the goal. Told you they lured me back in a big way with D&D. &D. I've been lured. Hadn't bought anything in a while, but I've always loved D&D. &D. Last time I forgot to see what color dice I got. Today we got this cool orange one. Same thing. Let's see what we got pack-wise here. Put that off to the side. Let's see what we got. Hopefully we can pull some goodies. Just when you think you're out, they pull you back in. Okay, so we have a Goblin Javelier. We'll stick these ones over here. Uh, common, common. Uncommon, keen. Eared Sentry. Burning Hands. Fly again, dancing sword, land token. Let's see what we got. The last one of these I opened was pretty good. Let's see, commons, come in, come in. You find some prisoners. Dun dun dun. Wild sheep, black dragon. Sorcerer class. I guess we could stick him over here. Ooh. Nice. The emblem for Loth. Common. See any of those alternate art cards? Spare dagger. Uh, commons. Commons. Urch. Prosperous Innkeeper, Guild Thief, White Dragon, I think that makes all the uncommons, Dragon Turtle. I think I got all the uncommon dragons now. Now we need to get the names. We need Tiamat. Commons. Hulking Bugbear, Dungeon Crawler, Tree Lasara Moon Dancer. That's got really good art. Frog Hemoth. Let's see what else we got here. I know people. Some of the people were complaining about dice, but a lot of people I talked to said, Oh yeah, this is going to bring fun back to the game. It hasn't been fun in a long time. Celestial Unicorn. Cleric Class Uncommon. Tiger Tribe Hunter. Man, again, that artwork's awesome. Raven Feeblement. This is pretty decent. Nadar Selfless Paladin. With the alternate art. Huh. Looks like the first edition Monsters Manual when the art was literally drawn by high school kids and friends of people that worked at the company when it was first starting out for D&D. &D. It's like, oh yeah, my wife can draw a little bit. Have her do it. Displacer Beast. Portable hole so you can store your stuff. You meet in a tavern. And Bard Class. Hmm. It's not double mythics like the last ones were. The last one of these was double mythic. Fat pack. Uh, Blink dog. Hmm. Power of persuasion. Dungeon map. Yun T. Mollison. 
dueling rapier foil and the art is just so good Art in this set is really good and the price that a lot of the original art sold for reflects how good it was <laughs> oh a plus two mace an alternate art pixie oh so cute that stay huh. 50 feet of rope warlock class chaos channeler oh Eliwick tumblestrom huh. Two fat packs, two planeswalkers. That's not bad. And I believe she's a character from the D&D game. One of the characters from those books. Let's see. Aberrant Mind Sorcerer. Sudden Insight. Red Dragon. Treasure Chest. That's pretty decent. Last pack. Come on, Tiamat. Come on, Dritz. And we skip through. I see a foil hiding back there of some kind. That one's got awesome art on it, too. Hama Pashar Ruin Seeker. Huh, you see a pair of goblins. Temple of the Dragon Queen. Ooh, that's cool. There's a full art card back there, too. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Icing Death Frost Tyrant, if that ain't awesome. And a foil treasure vault. Ha! <laughs> that's cool. And the fairy dragon in the back. Man. But that is nice. Icing Death Frost Tyrant. Full art. That is really cool. Well, now I need the rest of the name dragons. That was... Those have basically been two winners. So, hope you enjoyed and thanks for watching. We'll keep questing for that uh, Dritz and Dragons.